Okay, so let's get into it. Because most said a little bit, but I heard way a lot more. So, firstly, they say Meg walks on the stand. Okay, and she was looking cute, cute. Okay, she had her little bob going, her little suit. She was looking real cute. Her nails was cute. She was serving, okay? But when she gets on the stand, they said that she basically was saying how nervous she was, how she can't believe she really had to come up here and testify against um tori okay and that she didn't feel good mind you we got a twitter dude that was outside well a reporter and he asked her how she was feeling and she said she felt great but when she got in there she said she didn't feel good she felt sick but naturally in court you're gonna be nervous and i know because your girl didn't have no court cases to know in this lifetime that baby it is not a great feeling okay to be up in court whether you a witness or a criminal okay you just be wanting to get the on through okay so i get her feeling nervous okay so anyway so we get into all the juicy stuff first of all she's my bad my daughter called but anyway so basically she gets on the stands she completely denies ever back during kelsey saying that her and kelsey have never had an issue like that they were best friends they did everything together she says the only reason that her and kelsey have not talked for the last two years is because kelsey after this incident went to tori lane's room a hotel room and called her and told her about it so I don't think that was good because that paints a picture of jealousy again that everybody's not really grasping because even if she did go to his hotel room we ain't gonna go down so anyway um they asked her why did she lie about um you know like saying she was never intimate with tori and she says it's because people was turning this case into who she had slept with. She basically says her boyfriend is embarrassed. It's putting a real strain on her relationship because everybody keeps talking about who she slept with. And um, when she was explaining where Tori shot her from and how he shot her, her story had changed. Um, basically saying that he was over the window shooting her. However, before she said her back was turned, right? So, the problem that everybody is having is Meg's story has not been consistent this entire time. Tori, however, has told the same story from his album to his live to all of that. I feel like Tori just didn't want to tell on Kelsey. And I feel like he really saved it. But what they did make note of, they said Meg was in there with an attitude saying Tori shot her with a vengeance. So, we just going to keep watching.